About quarter past two this morning, we had a call to a large uh, amount of smoke coming from the premise behind us. When our trucks arrived, there was a significant fire and cabling underground. Um, we waited until we confirmed that there was isolation of power. It's a trans power site, so we're working closely with them. The cabling that's on fire is oil filled, and that's what's on fire. It's, al it's also filled under pressure, so we've turned the, isolated the pumps to the oil, um, and we've utilised foam to put the fire out. We don't know what sort of damage has happened to the site. The cables are underground. We won't be able to lift the lids on those until we get machinery in there. There's still a small amount of fire in the rear part of the, the um, substation. We're waiting until that part of the substation is isolated before we continue with that, that progress with that part of it. The area that's affected in Auckland is the, the old Auckland Electric Power Board site. We don't, as I said, we don't know how long that'll be isolated for. In this particular case, it is quite difficult. The oil being under pressure and being fairly low is being, uh, the oil is, is drifting down to the low points. So it's taken a significant amount of foam for us to, to extinguish the fire that we have. So you might be here for some while? We will be here for some while. We'll be here ensuring that the fire is extinguished before we can move to the next stage, which is seeing how much damage that we've got.